Hey guys, Kills of Thrills here, and we are back with some more Project Zomboid. As you can see, I am standing in front of a barrier. What you can't see is the fact that I forgot to hit record, uh, and we've just lost about 30 minutes of footage. So, <laughs> let me do a brief update of what's just happened. So this is the story of Jack Hitoff. Um, he has escaped the prison. Uh, he has decided that the prison is rather empty, and it might be a good idea to live here despite the fact that we'll have to run in and out of town until we find a car. However, uh, I actually went around last night and gathered loads of wood, loads of nails, and I dumped them on the floor here. The wooden nails are on the floor. Uh, I then, today, last night I done that, today, started building the defense. Uh, I got jumped by a couple of zombies in here, made me jump, I murdered them. Murdered this poor sod up here. A bit of banter was said. Zombies had a great time. We all became friends. Not really. I killed them all. Um, yeah. And then I proceeded to build all of these other uh, composts whilst talking utter rubbish. But you're not going to see that because I forgot to push record. Um, but we're almost there. We need one more compost to seal off this section here. And we need two more composts for the windows over there. I believe that's like eight nails. Uh, I don't think I've got any nails left. I've got any nails left. Please tell me I've got nails left. Oh, I've got loads of nails. Two, three, four. Four nails. And I believe that's like ten bits of wood, I think. So we can take that. I just don't want to... I just don't want to get jumped by a zombie whilst I'm doing this. That's the issue. Right, so I'm being very aware of my surroundings right now. Very aware. I feel like I want to get my nightstick out. There's not many zombies around. I've murdered, like, a lot. Oh, also, what I did say is I've taken all the zombies, or the majority of zombies, out of the main building and dumped them over here. That is the zombie pit. Uh, might set them on fire. Might not. I don't really know how it works in this game. I think fire might be a bad idea, and I might want to stay away from it. Um, it's just an idea. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. So I saw, th I saw this on how to do this on actually on YouTube. Uh, I came across a video and they said that zombies can't actually get across the composts. So if you can build a compost wall, you're absolutely fine. They don't attack it either. Um, but what you do need to do is you need to build a little way through. Oh my God, I've got no nails left. Oh, I do. <whistles> got loads of nails left, actually. Let's, uh, let's take all them. Uh, uh, I need to take more wood. I'll take all that. I know I'm taking a lot of damage, but once this done, Jack, you'll be alright, mate. Come on, Jack, you got this. You're a strong man. You're a strong criminal. Uh, I feel like I want to build... I'm going to build that last compost. Furniture, composter, there. There we go. Ah! Right, we are secure. No more wandering hordes can get in, unless... Now, hear me out here. Unless they can just, uh, is that it? Unless they could just find another way in. Which, is that all the wood? I think that's all the wood. Literally all the wood, isn't it? Yeah, there's no more wood. Okay. Well, we're secure. Um, the only thing we've generally got to deal with now is the bloody zombies that are walking around the perimeter. But I don't feel like I'm in any state to be dealing with them. I've got minor damage. It is late uh, and I'm hungry. So, I think going home, let's not get too cocky, because I know there's still zombies here. Let's turn that light on. This place is a mess. What a mess. Absolute mess. I can't believe I forgot to hit record. I'm kind of gutted a little bit, to be honest. Is there anything in here I can eat? Two pops. Uh... Nothing frozen. I'll tell you what, I'm going to take the pops upstairs. I can put them in the fridge. Coffee machine? Wait. What? I don't know what I use that for, but whatever. I think I've got a microwave upstairs anyway. Alright, I feel... feel somewhat secure. So I'm a little bit safer now, you know? 
a little bit safer than what I was before. Hell of a lot safer, actually, than what I was before. I know there's still zombies around, and I know I still need to be real careful, because they are around the forecourt area, uh, and they are... Is that on? Yeah, it is. And they are causing trouble. But, have I gone the wrong way? God damn it. Gone the wrong way. But we can eradicate. We'll, we'll, we'll purge the area as soon as we can. Problem is, I feel like we're probably going to miss a couple of stragglers, but I do need to find out. It's not the way, is it? It's this way. I do need to find out, like, where they are, like, how many there are out there, and I need to kill as many as I can. This bird needs to go out a window, but I can't open them up at the moment. Oh. I'm just happy we secured the place, you know? It's bloody dark. There are no lights in these hallways. All right, okay. Where was it? <laughs> ah, I, I don't always remember where I've been. It's the issue. Holy crap, it's dark in here. What's this area? Right, it's not this area, is it? No. Well, we are needing food, though. What's in here? Ice cream. Nice. I might just eat all that, you know, because he is losing weight. That's a lot of calories. All right, I'm going to eat all of the ice cream. That should sort him out for food. I'm getting ready for bed. I hate recording or trying to record and then just not hitting the record button. Drives me mad. Come on, Jack. You're doing good, mate. Quite happy about this, Jack. We are in a good position. We could survive for a long time, mate. As you can tell, <laughs> this office has been stripped. There is literally nothing in here. If I could demolish these beds down here, I bloody would have. Let's just have a little jog. Destroyed all this. There's literally nothing left, guys. I've destroyed it all. We wait until 12 o'clock, I reckon. Catch the 12 o'clock broadcast. How many people have we killed? Killed 48 people, and we survived five days. He's already survived longer than Ben, I think. Right, well, I feel like we're going to want to watch the program. We're going to speed it up. Well, our alarm's set for 5.30, so we'll get the morning TV show. But I feel like we could probably sleep till then. I feel like we are safe. I feel comfortable. This is where I'll probably get eaten. Please don't get eaten. There we go. Morning time. Morning, Jack. Morning, world. What is on the TV today? Let's have a little speed up till we can find our program. Let's take a sip. What's that? Cooking? Nice, nice. We're doing a bit of cooking. We, know, we need to know how to cook. We know how to cook. Of course we know how to cook. We're in a prison. Everyone takes cooking lessons in prison. What are we at? Cooking's level 2 now. Carpentry's almost level 3. Takes ages to level up bloody carpentry. Nimble, Lightfoot, and Sneaking's doing pretty good. Sneaky, uh, Sprint, not so much. Right. It is that time then. It is time to destroy the zombies. It's the only thing I can think of. We got uh, a bat. We've got our axe. I don't really want to lose my axe, to be fair. So, I'm just going to use the bat and probably... Yeah, one of the battens. There was another baton up here somewhere. I can't remember where it was. I did see it. It might be downstairs. Let's have a look down there. If I can get that, we'd have two. Uh, I know there's a pistol down here, but I need to sort out this place. It, it is a friggin' mess, man. There was another bat. <laughs> there was another baton. I can't remember where I put it. All right, don't matter. Doesn't matter. As you can tell, the storm of carpentry went through here. <laughs> it's literally nothing left. I'm not getting. All right, I thought I was going to get more zombies. Oh. 
I'm 100% sure I bumped all these outside. How long does it take for a body to go to decay? Like, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to dump these over here, I think. And then work my way outside, around. No one wants to see me move bodies, do you? That would be boring as well. Drop corpse. Let's drop him there. One of these cars, I've got keys. I keep finding keys. So one of these cars has got to have a key. I'm pretty sure. Oh, dear God. Set alarm. Turn that off. Oh, okay, it's not on. Pretty sure one of these keys I've got does one of these cars. If it does, I can always pick up the... Uh, the composts. All right, well, this is it. This is going to be the exciting job of running around the map. We have secured the compound. The compound is secured. It is ours. We just need to make it safe. So, purge. And strip in people. Oh, God, she's got maggots on her. I don't want to be dealing with that. I need to bury these bodies. Problem is, I don't know if you can bury them once they're all, like, infected and stuff. What we got? We got one zombie. Aww. Oh, and he's got scissors on him. I really need to start working on my tailoring as well. There's been a lot of comments about that. I need to work on my tailoring. I need to start stripping down some clothing and putting them in and off my clothes. There is a book about tailoring. Ah, he's got a bloody screwdriver in his back. Just gonna... These boots are made for stamping because that's what they do. One of these days, these boots are going to stamp all over you. Oh, that sucked. I know, I know. But Jack's lonely. In the prison by himself. Look at all those zombies. Look at those hordes of zombies. I mean, I'd call that a horde. I'd call that a horde, wouldn't you? It might just be like a few. Maybe you've seen more, but Jack hasn't. Jack is worried. Oh, once this place is secure, we can go into town and get ourselves killed. I mean, go into town and find some nice gear. Come on. I must commend these zombies. They have some really nice hairstyles. Like, I don't know how they've managed to stay so clean and tidy. During their little apocalypse and getting ripped apart by zombies. Uh, oh dear, there's what? There's five down. Oh, God. Holy crap. There's like six over there. There's five there. There's three up there. We're going to have to approach this real careful. Stop growling at me. You can't get in. Screw you. I don't even think I can jump this fence. Come on, Jack. You got this. What's that? Don't panic, mate. Don't panic. I should have took some beta blockers. I don't have any on me. Oh, crap. I'm carrying nows with me as well. All right, we got this. We got this. We're not going to get eaten now. Not chance. We're not going to get eaten now. I've just literally spent the whole bloody time. I've spent the whole evening chopping up wood. And I've spent the whole bloody time just gathering everything and securing this prison. All right, we've got one down. Push comes to shove, I'll get the axe out. No. Oh my god, he's cool. Ooh, you lucky sod. I just killed all your friends. You're just going to stand there or are you going to come down? You're just going to stand there. All right. Well, I'm going to strip them because it gets lonely in this prison when you're by yourself. Not really. I just want to see what they got. Plus, I can keep the clothes. I will go around and clean it all up. I want all the zombies out of the forecourt area. I want them around and dump somewhere safe. Away from bloody me, that's what I want. Come on! Madam? You're definitely a woman. Nice. Oh, I think I blocked it off just in time. I don't like these hordes walking around in here. They must have just strolled in and they just made their way around the building. Set the alarm on this. It's already off. A lot of stuff on the floor. 
tell you one thing, I never thought I'd see the day that I actually start to secure the prison. We've got a lone zombie over there, and then we've got a couple of hordes down here. I kind of want to kill these hordes. I'm going to get the axe out because I feel like I need the extra damage. Guessing it does more damage, right? Yeah. See if we can get like one or two to come over. I don't want to be dealing with a group of them that big. Are they pushing it? Am I right in thinking that they can't actually get through the fence, right? Right, that's six zombies, but we've got one coming. Let's get the let's get the baton back out. If they come out in drabs like one or two, I reckon I could deal with them. Just need to watch my ass, make sure no one sneaks up on me. Right, let's engage. Oh, I scuffed it. Oh, you bitch. Axe is probably a better idea. Come on, came in. Right. Oh. Fingers are hitting all the keys. Come on. Wow. Any sign of the day, mate? There we go. Nailed it. Oh, right. Woo! We're doing it. We're doing it, guys. I'm not going to strip them yet. Oh, she's got a leather coat, though. Map of Louisville and another leather coat. I'm kind of glad I battered them and I didn't uh, use anything else like the sharp instruments. But those leather coats I'm probably going to shred down and turn into strips. Not going to give you the chance. Another leather coat. Oh no, that's that one. I want this one. But you won't let me select the bodies, so it doesn't matter. What we got? A digital watch. Let's make sure that alarm is off. It is. I don't want to call the zombies. What we got? We've got two left. We've still got the one up to the left. Right, two left down here. I know there's a little horde around that corner. But we've got this. Sorry if my voice sounds a bit weird. I've still got a cold and I am slowly getting over it. It's just bloody taking its bloody time. Oh, I killed your friend. Yeah, don't worry. You're all right. I'll look after you. I'll let the other side decide what happens to you. Oh, man, it's going to take ages to do all these zombies, you know. I mean, not do the zombies. Why am I renaming the map? I want to read the map. Uh, probably the worst place. That I'll tell you what, I'll just grab it. I don't want to get caught. Out here, reading the bloody map, you know. There's another one up here. She's on her own. You guys communicating? If you are, you're about to watch me massacre your friend. Hello, love. Say goodbye to your fellow zombies. To be fair, I thought I'd push you over in one go. Clearly, I was wrong. Oh, she's putting up a fight. Classic watch that hasn't got an alarm on it. Strip her naked. It's not kinky. All right, it's nothing to do with kinkiness. It's more to do with the fact that I need to make sure that she uh, leaves all her gear behind or she rots. Is he inside? Is that a double fence? Is he inside the fence area? I think he is, you know. They're not inside the fence area, are they? They're on the outside, right? Is he on the inside? He is. I need, to, I need to deal with that. Can't be having him walking around the perimeter of the fence. But first, I need to get a little look around this corner. I need to see what's going on down here. Nothing. So what we've got, we've got zombies here. I've cleared all this area. We've got a group here that need to be dealt with. I'm going to use the axe on them because there's quite a few of them. 
I've got a feeling, I mean, I'm not going to be able to completely clear all the zombies. I know I'm not going to be able to completely clear them. I know there's going to be a few that I'm going to miss and they're going to be walking around. I just have to be on my guard and not, like, walk around the base naked. God, there's quite a few. Why are they all at that door? Guys, you don't want to come in here. He's got a hold all. Is that a hold all? No, it's a zombie's ass. Never mind. Alright, I'm getting the axe out. There's quite a few. I feel like I need to proper go at it. Plus, the nightstick looks like it's about to break. Sorry, father. Or not, because you bloody ambushed me. Or maybe you didn't, but one of your kind ambushed me earlier. One of your members of the cloth jumped me whilst I was walking out the door. Don't worry, though. Think it bit. Think it scratched. Murdered him. Oh. I completely missed that one. Not today, love. Not today. I'm sorry. So I'm sure you were well loved in your life as a human. And not a zombie. Oi! I need these doors kept in place. Thank you. Oh, he's got a, he's got a helmet. I'm going to switch over. I want that helmet. Turns out all I had to do is just push him down. Has he got a helmet? He bloody does. He has a hard hat. Nice. I'm going to wear that. Take my brains. There we go. Ah. I have found a slight issue in my plan, though. The slight issue being that... Um... Ah, there's the one that was trying to get in. Yeah, the slight issue being that I've only got one way in and out of the base, and if that gets compromised, I am screwed. That another one? Yeah, he's there. Don't worry. I know where you are, mate. Don't worry. It's another priest. So many priests. Well, we killed them. I've still got the guy walking down the fence. We're going to need to take him out. Starting to wish I'd killed the other three from before when I saw them. Uh, I didn't, which kind of sucked. I like to strip the zombies because I feel like it allows me to uh, come back around and get their gear. I could just sort out the bodies later, you know, like ditch them in a corner somewhere. So what we done? We've done all of that area out there. Uh, we've done all of this around here. There she is. She made it out. Good zombie. Are we hungry? How hungry are we? We are peckish. Uh, I didn't bring any food. Got some pop. Tell you what. Let's drink all the pop. There. Still peckish. Uh, let's drink the other one. Probably shouldn't, but... I feel like it'll probably help. There we go. Don't want to be killing zombies on an empty stomach. It's not the best idea. You coming over? Alright, why don't you come over then? I'll, uh... I'll strip some of these zombies. You still coming? Yeah, yeah, I'm still here. Don't worry. Come on, then. Come on, love. Nice green shoes, by the way. Trash talking zombies is going to get me bloody killed. I know that for a fact. Right, let's just uh let's just strip all these down. Another map, take that. Once they're all done, we'll uh we'll carry on with our, our amazing plan of eradicating every zombie in the area. I need to find a shovel. Like I really do I'd like to I'd like to bury them somewhere just so the area don't get rancid, you know? Because I've got a feeling it will be disgusting. Right, that area 
battery is done. We've got a zombie in there, which is cool. Uh, these are all dead. I mean, I know they're dead. They're all dead, but I mean, they're, they're dead, dead. There's no coming back from what I've just done to them. Nice nightstick across the face. It's enough to do anyone in. Look at the zombies just coming here. I must have drawn more over with my banging and stuff. I need to check this corner. Look at the state of it in there, look. There's no bloody tables. There's like one or two tables left. Right, there's no zombies in there. I swear to God, look. If I'm walking around this way and the zombies are just walking around the side and just jumping through my windows, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be annoyed. I wanna be safe, I wanna be secure. There's another one in the fence and there's another one. That'll be one of the three that I saw down here. So they've split up. So what I need to do is kill this one. Get the one in the fence to come around. What's he doing? Looks like it's almost like he's talking to his zombie friends. Hello, miss. This is the... Are you even wearing any underwear? You don't even look like you've got trousers. Oh. Wasn't concentrated. Oh, she's a hard one. Just give it up. Shut up. Oh, those zombies aren't happy. Is she wearing a leather coat? She was. I'm going to put that in the satchel. Oh, I'm encumbered. What else can I put in the satchel? Well, I don't know why I'm carrying eight nails, but we'll put them in there. Still encumbered. Okay, so let's drop the pop cans. I don't want to put the water in there. We don't need the hammer as of yet. We'll stick the hammer in there. And we're still encumbered. Uh, watches. Let's put them in there. <laughs> still. Look, don't panic. I know you're panicking. They're on the other side of the fence. They can't touch you. You are absolutely fine. You're safe. Trust me. I wouldn't trust me, but... You are safe. I think we got this, you know. It's going to take his time to get around to me. Looks like he's wearing another leather coat. Everyone over here is just wearing leather coats. Oh my god, look at them all. There's so many. I'm not fighting you in the fence perimeter, mate. You can come out here. I missed. No. Just fall over. Yeah, he's got another leather coat. All right. Well, I mean, I feel like they're taking the piss now. There's, there's, uh, there's. Where's all these leather coats I put in this bag? Oh, they're there. Three. Uh, I feel like we could just drop one. Because I am carrying a bit too much weight. There we go. That should sort me out for weight now. We're just uh, stripping. Oh, we're almost secure. We can't get comfortable, though, because getting comfortable in a place like this is uh, really, really bad. Oh, look at them all. Look at them. I'm glad they didn't have time to make their way in the building. We have got this, though. I don't think there's anyone else. I've got one guy around the other side near the prison block that I need to I need to get rid of. I'm pretty sure there's one in here as well, if I remember rightly. Is he in the fence? No. <laughs> this is amazing. Ah. <sighs> It's almost like the walking dead. Ah, oh, lone zombie out there. She can't get in. I haven't tested the composts in front of the windows. That's just me assuming that they can't get in through that. Uh, I could be completely wrong. 
uh, and they could get through. And if that results in people dying, then my bad, I'm sorry. Let's lob all that on the floor. We'll take the scissors. Get rid of all this. There's no flies. Is it like... Does the corpse, like, rotting happen when there's flies? Do the flies... Is it the flies? Like, when there's flies on them, then that's when you can't go near the corpse. Because if it is, then... Just kind of want to secure make sure this place is secure yeah 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 nice and secure right there was one zombie over the other side it's secure secure building oh we got this got this I feel like I kind of want to have a, have a little jog is he drowsy is he tired drowsy yeah I mean yeah he has been busy let's face it you have been busy, mate. I'll give you that. But let's not get too lazy now, eh? I know there's a zombie out here because he was banging at the window when I spawned in. Oh, that could be him there, though. I don't know. Is that him? Maybe he could be. Oh, there's two in here. Didn't realise there was two in here. Alright, well, we're going to have to deal with him. God. He is rotten. Stay away from that. How do I know that I'm infected? Do I get the disease? Does it just come up like you're not feeling very well or something? Alright, eliminate these two. And then there's the other guy on the other side. And then I think that's it. I think we've done the whole police... Uh, police? Uh, prison. I don't want my back to break mid-fight. Uh. Oi! That's it. One at a time. Line up. Line up. I think Jack's a bit... He's crazy. He's lost it. He's not, he's not doing bad for someone who's in here for burglary and fraud. His sentence is, uh, it's not, it's not so bad. But grab the key to leave just at the right time. Just before the zombie apocalypse was going to happen. Turns out that it's, uh, now become his permanent home. Hello, mate. you got an amazing beard. Some nice hair as well. Shame to mash it up. I'm going to mash it. Sorry. Just... There we go. I didn't mean to. It's just, you know, it's nothing personal. But you did just get blood away my window. All right. It's him dead. Secure in the prison. Beginning the purge. Purge. Purge? Purge. One of them ones. We'll accept either one. Can't really pronounce me words properly anyway at the moment. My, uh... My throat's so sore right now. It's like sandpaper. I know he's hungry. And I know he's drowsy, but... We can't really take the time out. We need to... Uh, we, oh, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. What I'm going to do... Oh! They can still get in! Hell! I didn't think they could get through the windows. Blocks them off. How are they still getting in? Oh, maybe it doesn't work when they're on the, in front of the windows. Unless he was one of the stragglers that are outside. Oh, it doesn't work when they're near windows. Oh, that sucks big time. Gonna have to secure this place even better. Is he going to die? Ah, oh, so, okay, well, that answers my question. Compost near the window doesn't work. They can still get in. If I've got wood, can I... 
can't even barricade it. I don't even have any wood on me right now. I've used it all. Alright, well, they can still get in. They can still get in through the window where there's compost. So I, I just assumed it would stop them. Maybe because they see it as a part they can get across. They can't climb over this, though. I'm pretty sure that's still... Still in, in place. So I, I've, I've used it since they updated it. If they've changed it and they can actually climb through that, okay, I'm going to be uh, a, a tad annoyed. Because... I've just spent all my time building those bloody things. Mm, what we're we gonna do about these windows then? Unless I just bring it out further. Two, three, four, five, and put five. Oh man, that's gonna take ages. Need to keep myself safe though. Can't be uh, dealing with the zombies just popping in every time they feel like they want to have a little jolly. Anyway. These zombies are going to have to go outside at some point. I'm going to... I'll clear up the zombies later. For now, though. We need to go across here. To the other side and see if we can eliminate that other zombie in the other area. There's none in there. Good. Oh, God. There's zombies here. There's zombies everywhere. I've cleared all these up. I don't like this door being open still. I still don't like this area. I feel like I kind of want to build another door and put it in place. I'm pretty sure I left all my food. Like, stuff in that bag. That bin bag. I'm pretty sure... It's down here. I've even stripped the coat, cloakroom. Look, there's literally nothing there. There it is. Do I have food in it? Uh, got a lot of medicine. Carpentry. Cereal. Ah. Oh. Eat. All. Oh. There we go. That sort that out. Is he losing weight? No. Oh my god, he's 78. How'd you put weight on in this? I mean, that's a lot of calories I've just eaten. Let's eat all of it. There we go. Woo, that is going up. Double speed. You fat sod. Right. Let's fill my water bottle up before we head over to the other side to uh, destroy the other zombies. Uh, our nightstick is on its way out. I believe I can't repair it. I don't think I've got the skills to. I'm going to round all this stuff up. It'll make great firewood. I feel good about this character, you know. I feel like he's going to survive for uh, at least another two days. <laughs> before he gets killed. But we do need to get rid of that character. And we need to figure out something to do with those doors down at the bottom. I could just mine up loads of... Mine up? Cut down loads of trees. Trees? Bloody hell. Furniture. I mean, there's still loads of tables in places. There's still a lot I can do. These hallways are so, so dark. It's not the way out, is it? That leads me into the prison cell area. I don't think there's any lights in these prisons. Oh, there is. It's there. There we go. We can see. Right, we need to get out here. I don't know. The door must be like down here. Unless that's it up there. That could possibly be it. Oh, that's a window. How do I get into that area? That's the learning area, so it's not there. It'll be down one of these. No, shut the doors. 73 zombies killed, though. He's doing much better. Much better than I normally would. Although we need to be careful, because if the water goes out, we're screwed. We've got nothing. We've got a few, actually, we've got a few water things, and I need to stick all them in one area. Oh, here we go. This is it. It's getting late. He's not hungry, but he's very tired. It's just this last zombie, and then secure the other area. But for now, I feel like we will be satisfied just clear, killing this zombie. And that should sort it out. 
Where'd he go? Definitely was one here. I remember seeing him. He was here. I saw him. Is that him? Oh, he's sitting down. Oh my god, I thought he was dead. Hello, mate. I'm very tired. I haven't got time to mess around, so... We can just make this quick. It'll be amazing. Yeah? Just stay down, please. Just stay down. Don't get up. Come on. There it is. Alright. <sighs> Sorted. Alright. Nice, nice. We have secured the prison somewhat. We've got to figure out what to do with those windows. Maybe barricade them up for now. Like they'll just attack them and get in, but that's the only way in. We really need to secure that area. Once that area is secure, we should be alright. I mean, no one else can get in and out of the prison. I'm pretty sure my barriers at the front are hold. Until then, well, I mean, we're just going to have to keep annihilating zombies until we can figure out how to block it off. I feel like more composts, which will mean that I have to dismantle the rest of the bloody prison. But, I mean, there's still a lot of stuff in here that I could dismantle. I feel like I'm going to run. Although he's very tired, I don't see any zombies around to have to deal with anymore. Our bed area is upstairs, and he's not hungry now, so... Doing alright. There's enough bin bags around as well. I mean, there's another nightstick somewhere. I saw it, but I can't remember where it was. Nothing. Nothing. Uh. Nothing. Damn it. Oh well. Uh, I get a feeling that we are very bloody, though. Um, you know what? I might actually wash up before we go to bed. Because extremely bloody isn't good, right? Come on. There we go. We've had a hard day of murdering some zombies. Uh, I, I think the sink's like this way. Getting so cocky, I'm gonna end up getting killed. I know I am. Here we go. Sink. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, wash all clothing. Could have just gone to the laundry area and whacked it all in the washing machine. It would have worked perfect, but it don't matter. All right, wash yourself, cause you are a dirty boy. And feel. Ah, uh, that's fine. We will round up like all the cups and plates and everything that we can get, and we will uh, we'll fill them all with water, so we could at least drink uh, if the water runs out. We'll round up all these and put them in our living area. But I do need to find a bed because at the moment I haven't got a bed, or a proper bed. I can't pick these ones up. These are in place, like in place. I don't think you can move them. But that's that. All right, let's have a little sleep, shall we? Because he is done. And there it is, morning again. So, I feel like I'm going to leave this one here. We've done really well. We blocked off the front of the prison. We have a little leaking area where the zombies can still get in, but we'll have to deal with that. I need to somehow figure out how to gather up blood wood now. There's plenty in this building. I just need to dismantle it all. It's going to take ages. I'm going to do that off camera because it's boring. Um... We've eliminated the zombies that were in the area, I think. I'm pretty sure we got them all. We're doing all right. I just need to round up all the stuff and get everything ready for us to live. And then we all need to do a little trip into town because we need a car. Uh, and we need resources, like a lot. I want to be able to get in and out of the base before the zombies become too much. If they become too much, we're not going to be able to move. Uh, we've got an armory, which is good. We've got guns and ammo, which is, again, good. It's just actually using it. When it comes to it, I feel like we're probably going to have to use it. It'll be our last stand, but it is what it is. So, uh, yeah, thanks for coming, guys. Thanks for watching. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of Jack Hitoff's uh, story, then subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for coming. Bye.